My name is Edward Butterman, and I'm a retired business professional from the, working in the United States. Well, at the time, at the moment, we live in the Marlboro area, but we wanted to continue. Um, we wanted to continue our, our search here and move on to something. Uh, move on to something new. We were looking for a particular type of area uh, with a particular type of um, architecture, um, with, a partic with particular amenities, um, which we we have been searching for oh, for maybe three or four months. I learned of Punta Cana Solutions through Instagram. Um, I feel social media is a great tool for putting yourself out there, but of course it doesn't give you much more than just a simple introduction to, a, to an organization. My experience with, uh, with coming to Punta Cana Solutions was, was good. I reached, out to, I reached out to the organization through Instagram, um, was responded to almost immediately, and upon that we began a relationship of exchanging a certain number of messages and then ultimately we came to meet with us with meet here in the office with the staff personally i think my experience with nestor has been great um, nestor i feel that nestor is a, is a is a consummate professional as well as a very personable individual um, his responsiveness is incredible his knowledge of the area and of real estate which i consider to be two separate things i really find uh, i really find incredible um, his experience is in both the rental markets, as well as the investment markets, as well as the personal investment markets, I find unmatched to any of the other real estate organizations that, that I've had experience with. Well, the experience was a very smooth experience. Um, Nestor's knowledge allowed us to kind of very rapidly, um, very rapidly move through the, through the process of not only selection, but through, through negotiation. When we came to Punta Cana Solutions, we had also heard different information from other organizations. But Nestor came to us with different information. He came to us with more accurate information, as well as information we had not heard from other organizations. So the process was a very smooth process because when you're sitting in front of someone who has not only knowledge of the area, but knowledge of the builder, knowledge of the property, um, and can um, partake that information, uh, can, can bring that information to a person, it, it, it makes them more comfortable through the process of negotiation. All of our questions were answered during negotiation, and in fact, many of our questions never got asked because Nestor would share much of the information with us prior to us having to answer questions. And that's a, and, and that's a wonderful um, attribute to have as, as a person in both a business relationship as well as a personal relationship. When we went looking, we started out with, with the, we started out kind of at the macro level and we wanted to look at Vista Cana. We liked what the development appeared to be offering, the diversity of it, the different types of sub-residentials. We liked the idea of multiple uh, access and exits. And as we began looking, we began looking through the different types of offers that were within Vista Cana. We like the idea of that there's a business center, there's a potential for a hotel, there's going to be retail and commercial space. We thought the idea of, of a beach was great. We learned through Nestor that there was a second beach being developed. So as we, as we went through our look, then we began working our way down to the micro level as we ruled out townhouses or individual apartments. And ultimately, when we saw, when we saw Savannah, the idea of the way that the property was laid out, whether it was its green space, whether it was the architecture of the homes, the idea that it sits in an equestrian type environment, which is, which is very different. The way that they were uh, adding amenities, uh, you know, such as uh, supermercado, the way they were adding um, um, trails for walking, the way that they were, the way that there is, you know, the, the future potential for many different things. And then also the fact, the way that the properties were laid out. We ruled out a lot of different properties in a lot of different areas because they were just too close. There was just not a lot of room between them. We liked the way that these properties were, you know, were laid out and the way that the entire, the entire sub-development was laid out. I think without a, without a doubt, um, as a former business, business person, you hope that a person will continue do, doing business with an organization that they not only trust, but that they feel comfortable with. And without a doubt, we would go on and, and 
will continue to go on referring this organization to both friends, families, and other business professionals that we know because of the experience that we received. I, 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 guess, I, I guess if I had to say any final thoughts or recommendations, find a real estate professional that you can feel comfortable with opening up and explaining yourself to and allowing them to guide you through a process. If all that a person is doing to you is delivering properties for you to look at, then it's a transaction. But if a person is bringing properties and bringing thoughts and bringing ideas and bringing direction, then it's a relationship. And, and it's the relationship that will go on to make the experience far better.